ya. De nada. Let's get down to it. The grand finals of this tournament with Poyo coming all the way from Peru against Oba and Pineda, also teaming up with his cousin Liv. Liv using Daisy, which remember, she's the Echo, so she plays just like Peach. And now Poyo staying with his main from Smash 4, Sonic the Hedgehog, one of the few Sonics we see in the game. Oh snap, but no, Oba loses his first stock already. Looking already so much different from the loser's final and the last two sets they played. Already at a disadvantage. Not looking quite the same ever since the beginning of game three. They didn't see themselves quite in quite this bit of disadvantage. So they're gonna have to work really hard to get back into it. Oh no, another footstool! Poyo's specialty is doing that, just a couple of footstools and that'll do it. Amazing work coming from him, but now also Leaf loses his first stock. What's happening over here? Oh no, okay, so a very important situation where Oba and Panetta have, well sorry, Oba and Leaf had both lost their stocks and now finally Poyo loses his too. But not really a big disadvantage situation quite yet. All right, just some, fixing up some information on the stream. Remember, Oba and Panetta are already coming from the loser's side, so they're going to have to win two sets in case they want to take this whole tournament. Back into it, Panetta let the limit cross slash takes away Leaf's second stock. Oddly enough, Poyo is doing a pretty fantastic job covering his stocks. He hasn't quite lost that much, doing a pretty great tanking, uh, tanking job. And also the combos, he gets a lot of damage onto Panetta. And now with that up smash, Oba's last stock is gone. And it seems like he's not going to steal Panetta's stock quite yet. He would rather do the solo, it seems. And yes, it was only a matter of time before he lost it. With a forward air, Leaf clutches it out and takes out Panetta's second stock, who is now going to try and end Poyo's life, but he won't quite make it. A, a spike, trying to get the spike there, but now Poyo very smart with the DI into the stage, and he makes it back. Panetta now being juggled between the two teammates. Forward smash coming from Poyo, and a forward air on stage. Weird how that KO'd, however that makes it. And now... Leaf trying to two-frame him, but no, the forward smash. No, you don't want to hit your teammate. But there's no way they're making it back now, or is there? Okay, Panetta makes it back barely. Pretty smart doing that, capitalizing off of the up B that Leaf was going to use anyway. And now it's not quite as big of a disadvantage situation as it used to be. Trying to get him, and yes, that forward air will do it. Leaf and Poyo take game one on Pokemon Stadium. We're gonna go right back into it, game two. Three, two no character switches. One, it's quite amazing go. how Leaf, I'm sorry, how Panetta has stayed loyal to his old Smash 4 main cloud. And it seems like we have three people who really like their Smash 4 mains. And Oba also used Lucina back in the day, so this is looking like a Smash 4 set only in Ultimate. Panetta loses his first stock already, however, and Oba also takes it out. Leaf loses his first stock to a spike coming from Oba. That down air being quite clutch, but now Poyo up to avenge his cousin. He barely has any damage on him. Actually, Oba and Poyo both looking quite similar in terms of how they're doing on their team, respectively. But now Panetta trying to take Leaf with him, and he doesn't make it. 
Oba is also in a pretty bad situation. He makes it back to his stage, however. But Panetta already lost his second stock. That's the problem with Cloud. He has a terrible recovery. And it's being exploited quite a bit by Leaf in here. It seems like the matchup has changed a lot since Smash 4. And now Pollo finally loses his first stock. However, Oba also has his first still. It's gonna take quite a bit to finish it, but nope. That forwarder won't do it either. They're trying to both get back into the ledge. Panetta with the down smash doesn't cut it. And with the limit he's being used to use, he's being forced to use. No, the forward air, an accident, an absolute accident. He takes off Oba's first, second stock, no, yeah, first stock, sorry. And Leaf's second stock also goes away. Just like that, the tables have turned and it's looking quite even all of a sudden. However, the momentum, I would say, is still on blue team's favor because Panetta is one gimp away from losing it all. Oba, however, doing a pretty good tanking job once again. No, Pollo, okay. Very smart, holding Panetta, sorry, holding Leaf there. And now Panetta's last stock is gone and it's two stocks to three. One stock apiece for the red team. And it's looking quite dangerous because Panetta has been gimped so many times. Oba has only lost one stock so far. And it's going to be pretty sad if Panetta loses, uh, well, four of them, really. However, a back here and also ticks out Poyo. Well, never mind. It's not quite as dis as a big as a, dis of a disadvantage as I thought. Oba keeps him off stage, but now goes back into there. Panetta trying to use the cross slash. The regular cross slash doesn't quite cut it either. It's Poyo against the world. He's going to have to abuse of Sonic speed as much as he can to get away from their moves. Panetta with the limit still still charged. But it's about to run out, so be careful with that. He's camping around perfectly, however. Only there does the sword dance from Oba connect, but they're barely doing any damage on Poyo. He's getting some chip damage here and there. However, finally, the ping pong situation. Here, Dutch is off stage, but he does make it back. He now keeps Oba on top of the stage over at the ceiling, but no. Okay, good situation there for Poyo, but no, back in the disadvantage. He's gonna have to air dodge quite a bit. He makes it back. He has no air dodge now. Another up B? Will he make it? Well, he did get the air dodge back with that hit from Panetta. Barely makes it back. Oh, but trying to connect that up smash. He doesn't make it. Poyo also trying to true trying to two frame with the forward smash. Doesn't connect. But he is barely there. He is slowly climbing this mountain, but no, the backer will it do it? No, but now Oba is going there, trying to finish it all. Limit cross slash that doesn't connect from Panetta. Poyo is doing an amazing job camping it out, but no, the down air catches him off guard. Well, the red team celebrates. We're going into game three, but remember, this ain't quite over yet. Por cierto, chat, yo sé que estoy hablando en inglés y todo, pero no tengan miedo de comentar si les está gustando o no. Well, we're going into final destination now. Here's the thing: Sonic loves to run, Peach loves to float, and there's nothing here trying to stop him from doing that. No character switching. Well, yeah, Panetta did switch to Peach, but come on, it's the same thing. Except some people consider Peach less annoying. So, yeah, same thing. <laughs> three, two, We're getting one, into it. Game three of the grand finals. The plain eyes from Peach on that turn up. No, 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 no. Look out for that leaf. You don't want to hit your cousin. Family violence ain't cool. Getting into it. They're getting a lot of damage on to Panetta. He is looking like quite the punching bag right now, but now Oba helping out that disadvantage situation. Panetta, however, swings his sword and hits Oba too. Now Panetta has his limit charged, and remember, any cloud with limit is a pretty dangerous one, especially if he's off stage because he will make it back. However, he is about to lose it. He has to use a limit blade beam to get Poyo off of him. And now they have everything to their advantage. They could have taken Oba out, but now 
charges the neutral B and leave rolls into it. Very unfortunate situation, but now Oba, no air dodge, but no two frame coming from Leaf either. Back throw from Poyo, trying to two frame Panetta this time around, but no, the up B saves him. And Peach barely makes it back too. Poyo trying to catch Panetta on top of the stage, but no, nothing being dealt quite yet. Leaf is going to have to camp it out and help his cousin because it's not looking that fun. Panetta will have to choose his get-up option really smart, and yeah, he does. Parrying that Blade Beam. Nope, Leaf, don't hit your cousin. That's kind of bad. And now both members of the red team with a lot of red percentage on them. They're going to have to be careful. Okay, finally, some back here from Poyo takes out Panetta's first stock. He was doing a pretty great camping job. Finally loses it, but now the side tilt from Panetta too gets rid of Poyo. And now the backer from Oba 2 trying to reverse edge guard. Nope. Ain't nothing gonna happen to me, he says. Not even gonna try to edge guard him, but let's trap him and it works. Panetta on the other side of the stage. Well, Oba lost Oba lost his second stock. No, his first stock again. Perfect camping from him. A really good tank. Oba is turning out to be. Whereas Panetta is still quite the punching bag of the red team. And now leave. Using his offense to his advantage, he is the one approaching. I think he should be the one camping, but hey, I don't make the rules here. They have their synergy. Hoyo, however, just waits for Leaf to send anybody flying into him. And Sonic doing what he does best, spinning and rolling around at the speed of Sam. Trying to juggle Oba now. Look out for that. Panetta had Poyo off stage and he barely makes it back too. Board smash that Leaf escapes from. And now he's trying to edge guard. Okay, they take Panetta's second stock, which is a quite good thing, but no. Leaf loses his second one too. Oba loses the second one as well, however. And now we're even Stevens on stocks. Poyo, is he going to make it back? Yeah, he does. Oba. Barely escaping that combo, but now Poyo is going to have to be very careful. Any mistake is going to cost him, and there it is. Oba catching his pin dash with that uh, forward air, which makes it. And now it's a 2v1 with Leaf on the front. Short stands coming from Oba. Wow, Panetta makes it all the way down under the stage. Any situation for a two frame, but no, the limit won't do it. No, Oba suicides, but the back air from Panetta. Oh, extremely clutch. What happened there? <laughs> Oba trying to disrespect Leaf. He doesn't make it, however. Just barely doesn't connect. She's in the stage now. We're gonna go to town and Team Battle Sonic Fushina. Three, two, one, go! Let's get into it. Game four. Nobody wants to get up quite yet. The blue team, however, is going to have to work extra hard for this one because they're at a disadvantage in games. And here's where the synergy gun is going to come along. So far, it seems like both teams have been playing separate 1v1s and meet on each side on the stage. When it's time for a last for an edge guard, however, they go for the one who is on stage. They don't care about the one off of it. It seems like the plan works for each one of them. However, the neutral game is really going anywhere right now. Anytime any of the teams gets to advantage and the other loses it. Panetta with the limit still charged there. He has yet to use it. Leaf just waiting for him to throw Poyo. And here we go. Here's where the massacre begins. They have them both on the ledge, but no, the, the rules switch around. Reverse edge guards? No. Polio and Panetta both go flying Dragon Ball Z style. And the forwarder from Peach is going to do it for Daisy. Sorry, Leaf takes out Oba's first stock. 
And now he has everything to edge guard Panetta, but no, Oba coming in clutch. Lee barely makes it back. Panetta trying to connect those spikes again. Those downers have always come clutch for him on the ledge. He barely makes it back and he doesn't take Poyo's stock. It would have been very easy to hit with that limit up B. However, he does make it back safe and sound. Neutral from neutral error from Lee to land on the stage. But a downer is going to do it, and Daisy screams for her life as she loses her first stock. Panetta is still looking quite healthy over there. They have yet to take his stock, and it's looking a little more likely that Oba will commit some accident. I actually called that one. And also, Panetta loses his first stock, so it's looking like an absolute breeze for the blue team this time around. Poyo is still keeping his first one. Oh, but now he goes way too deep. And now it depends on Leaf to go and protect Poyo. He does, however, and they're back on the stage, both of them. Panetta tosses out that blade beam, but the up air from him actually takes out Poyo's first stock too. And here we go, looking for that gimp. Is it going to do it? Tilt comes in clutch and the side B. The hip hits from Daisy is going to do it, Poyo. Still with his second stock, Leaf still with his second stock, Panetta loses his last one. This is looking like a fourth stock. The stage selection was amazing for the red, for the blue team. It's looking very unlikely that the red team will want to go back to any triplet stage. Ah, dos uno. Parece que dos es. No vayas a hacer una rene, por favor. Back in this, Oba is still trying to fight for his life, however, it's gonna take just one ping pong situation for the blue team to end it all. Tossing out those sword hits, so far so good, spacing it well. Neutral air, but now he is on a edge guard situation, he does make it back. The dash attack from Polio, I think that must have been a miss input, however, it was the only move that was going to catch him there. Dead eyes from Lee, but no, it doesn't capitalize off of it. That does quite a bit of damage. It's not a stitch face, but it's still quite strong. The parry and Oba makes it back. Not yet. Still with the ledge trap, they have yet to be successful on any of them. Oba fights for his life, but a forward smash from Poyo makes this a 2v2. And if the blue team wins this game, they're going to take the entire tournament. Team battle. No character switches. They're staying with their characters till the end. Obligame. Here we go, back at Pokemon Stadium 2. This had worked wonders for the red team previously. However, it did too for the blue one. As they won game one in this stage. And once again, Poyo doing an amazing tanking labor. The only hit he has received was from Leap. So that takes, I mean, that says quite a bit about the offensive work of the red team and the blue team. Leaf trying to sort his combos, however, at this percent it's going to be quite difficult. Some great DI from Panetta, that great smash DI to fall off Peach's combos. They're both making it back to the stage, however, the Limit Blade Beam hits Oba, and he is now at a pretty right percent. Panetta just swinging around the stage, not tossing out any random moves. He prefers to position himself well before tossing anything out and compromising to anything. Neutral R from Leaf takes away Oba's first stock and now the backer from Poyo does the same for Panetta's first and the red team is gonna have to make a really clutch comeback because this mountain is looking quite tall to climb. Fun fact, today I did climb a mountain, it was pretty fun. Now back into this game, Poyo, center stage, no, Leaf keeps hitting Poyo. It's amazing how much many of the commercials that they get they accidentally hit each other. It's not that much because the red team is actually hitting them. Oba already on 80%, Panetta at 69%, 78. 
giving him outside. He's going to have to use the blade beam. The up beam. No, he doesn't make it into the ledge. He doesn't make it back on stage. And a downer sour spot from Oba. Takes away Leap's first stock. Poyo is still keeping his first one. Oba at 100%. He is a target right now. And Panetta is still receiving a lot of damage from both of them. The Toad coming in clutch. They can still try to gimp Panetta, but now he makes it back. And now Oba with the center stage. Poyo charging the forward smash, trying to bait Oba into running into it. He also goes down and saves Panetta. The up B, however, doesn't make it back, and that's it for Oba's second stock. And it's looking like another four stock because the blue team has five, the red team has two. Panetta, no, with the up B, the absolute accident. It was a miss I guess. He was looking the other way. It seems like this is it. Is it going to be a five stock or a four stock? Oba trying to hunt down Poyo. He wants to take away his stock at least. The honor stock, neutral B, is Poyo going to approach? He does, but the down tilt from Oba prevents him from getting any closer. Is this it? Oh, no tech coming from Leaf. Is he going to make it back? He does, and Poyo still fighting there. Oba, will he do it? Will he make it back? He does, but barely. No reverse edge guards this time around. He makes it back into the stage, center stage. He occupies it, no problem, no questions asked. However, that's going to be it. Leaf and Poya are the grand champions of the doubles tournament at this weekly with a five stock. <laughs>